It was a must-win Saturday afternoon as the Okanagan Sun took on the visiting Kamloops Broncos. To the first quarter, the Okanagan Sun on the 10-yard line. Giorno secures the handoff and puts the Okanagan Sun on the board. <laughs> Later in the first, the Broncos QB overthrows Brennan Plant and Blake Butler of the Sun intercepts. Then Sun quarterback Cam Bador is sacked, which leads to the Broncos getting on the board with this safety. And he will just take a knee. To cap off the turnover-plagued first quarter, the Sun quarterback is on the run and throws an interception and Adam Nesbitt of the Broncos runs it down the field to about the 16-yard line. With the Okanagan Sun up 7-2 at the beginning of the second quarter, the Broncos line up for a field goal attempt and put it through the uprights. The Okanagan Sun 7, the Kamloops Broncos 5. Later in the second, Dubinsky off a tip intercepts the ball and runs it down to the 5-yard line, which sets up Mikhail Meloff with this opportunity to increase the Sun's lead. But it wasn't meant to be. Soon after, Homan is handed the ball for the touchdown. 14-5 Sun. And going into halftime, the Okanagan Sun pick up yet another point because of a miscue by Kamloops. The score at the half, 15-5 Okanagan Sun. The Sun would turn up the heat in the third when Alex Bradley is handed the ball at the snap, dodges a few tackles and crosses the line into the end zone. The Broncos fail to advance the ball down the field when their quarterback underthrows the ball and Sheldon McDonald of the Sun catches it and brings it all the way back down the field for a touchdown. Following a field goal, the Sun are up 29-5. And it's not over yet. On the ensuing kickoff, the Broncos fumble the ball, which sets up Ben White for the touchdown. <laughs> then Alex Bradley decides he wants some more action and runs the ball into the end zone as well. At the end of the third quarter, the Okanagan Sun have a commanding 42-5 lead. In the final quarter, Kamloops would mount a bit of a comeback with a couple of touchdowns of their own, but it wouldn't be enough as the Okanagan Sun would hold on and win for the first time at home. The final score, the Okanagan Sun 42, the Kamloops Broncos 18. We watched a lot of film, you know, we prepared really hard this week in practice, you know, we looked at some of their routes on film, so we kind of knew what to expect. And, and as soon as we recognized it, you could tell that we were just all over it, you know, interceptions and and just tackles. They didn't really muster much all day, so it was a really good week of preparation. We uh, wanted to come out strong right from the start, uh, change that up from the last game, and uh, we did We did that, uh, but once again, we came out hard uh, later on in the game, and we just need to uh, put that at the start. Oh, well, it's tremendous. Anytime you can celebrate with a bunch of guys and they can start feeling good about themselves, take the pressure off, it was outstanding. So, uh, you know, they got 24 hours, you know, enjoy themselves, you know, be safe, and uh, get back to work.